By those winds scattering dust, dispersing, and those clouds carrying a load of water, and those ships sailing with ease, and those angels apportioning each matter. Indeed, what you are promised is true, and indeed the recompense is to occur. By the heaven containing pathways, indeed you are in differing speech. Deluded away from the Quran is he who is deluded. Destroyed are the falsifiers, who are within a flood of confusion and heedless. They ask, when is the day of recompense? It is the day they will be tormented over the fire and will be told, taste your torment. This is that for which you were impatient. Indeed, the righteous will be among gardens and springs, accepting what their Lord has given them. Indeed, they were before that doers of good. They used to sleep but little of the night. And in the hours before dawn they would ask forgiveness. From their properties was given the right of the needy petitioner and the deprived. And on the earth are signs for the certain in faith. And in yourselves, then will you not see? And in the heaven is your provision and whatever you are promised. Then by the Lord of the heaven and earth, indeed it is truth, just as sure as it is that you are speaking. Has there reached you the story of the honored guests of Abraham? When they entered upon him and said, We greet you with peace. He answered, And upon you peace. You are a people unknown. Then he went to his family and came with a fat roasted calf and placed it near them. He said, Will you not eat? And he felt from them apprehension. They said, Fear not and gave him good tidings of a learned boy. And his wife approached with a cry of alarm, and struck her face and said, I am a barren old woman. They said, Thus has said your Lord. Indeed, he is the wise, the knowing. Abraham said, Then what is your business here, O messengers? They said, Indeed, we have been sent to a people of criminals to send down upon them stones of clay, marked in the presence of your Lord for the transgressors. So we brought out whoever was in the cities of the believers, and we found not within them other than a single house of Muslims. And we left therein a sign for those who fear the painful punishment. And in Moses was a sign when we sent him to Pharaoh with clear authority. But he turned away with his supporters and said, A magician or a madman. So we took him and his soldiers and cast them into the sea, and he was blameworthy. And in Ad was a sign, when we sent against them the barren wind. It left nothing of what it came upon, but that it made it like disintegrated ruins. And in Thamud, when it was said to them, Enjoy yourselves for a time. But they were insolent toward the command of their Lord, so the thunderbolt seized them while they were looking on. And they were unable to arise, nor could they defend themselves. And we destroyed the people of Noah before. Indeed, they were a people defiantly disobedient. And the heaven we constructed with strength, and indeed we are its expander and the earth we have spread out, and excellent is the preparer. And of all things we created two mates, perhaps you will remember. So flee to Allah, indeed I am to you from him a clear warner. And do not make as equal with Allah another deity, indeed I am to you from him a clear warner. Similarly, there came not to those before them any messenger, except that they said, a magician or a madman. Did they suggest it to them? Rather, they themselves are a transgressing people. So leave them, O Muhammad, 
for you are not to be blamed. And remind, for indeed the reminder benefits the believers. And I did not create the jinn and mankind except to worship me. I do not want from them any provision, nor do I want them to feed me. Indeed, it is Allah who is the continual provider, the firm possessor of strength. And indeed, for those who have wronged is a portion of punishment, like the portion of their predecessors, so let them not impatiently urge me. And woe to those who have disbelieved from their day which they are promised. <laughs>